what it do cosmic crew like comment and subscribe if you're new without further ado i got another video for you so as you can see this is about Lil yachty okay um it is virgo season he's my first virgo now when i do these readings they still have to have some type of relevancy okay so he was currently trending or just being discussed one about him and um caribou um he released <laughs> he released the reference track where he basically made it clear that he's he he wrote the verse he said that he made sure that the beat was put a certain way so that her verse was lit and you know kind of giving himself his just due when it comes to who she is and her notoriety her fame okay now one thing about virgos they are brutally honest um <laughs> like historically like <laughs> brutally honest very straightforward um very cutthroat um they say what they mean they mean what they say he also was on his podcast and he kind of was asking his friend you know if i wasn't your friend and i wasn't you know already in this position you know do you think you would be who you are or where you are right now and that was taking different ways things of that nature but um that that's just kind of what you get fucking with a virgo like they don't really uh sugarcoat i don't know if that's possible I don't know if that's possible, honey. Okay, let's just see. Um, What's the energy as it stands for the concrete boys? Now, from what I see, this isn't the first group that Yachty has tried to put together. Um, also he said that you know he's the fashion designer he's the one that got everybody dressed like his input is what made everybody like it and i do feel that energetically he feels that he doesn't get enough credit for his expertise i guess you would say <laughs> He doesn't get enough credit for his expertise for his impact ah he doesn't get enough credit for how he's impacted um the culture so let's see what's going on what is what is all this now i have done a reading um on caribou just about this now he said that she's really mean the way she talks to people really crazy and if i'm not mistaken she's an aries okay so that that wouldn't be too far-fetched um <laughs> that wouldn't be too hard to believe but that's his perspective but let's just see what's going on with this situation you know i feel like his feelings are hurt more than anything okay he feels like they're supposed to be like family um but he's also okay with letting her go and pursue whatever it is that she feels she needs to on an individual basis but it's also something like okay but i'm gonna need my cut um if you rap in these lyrics if this is what made you hot this is why i'm hot he's gonna yeah he's definitely gonna need his percentage i don't know what contracts that they've agreed upon but yeah he wants his money he wants his money he wants his cut he wants his percentage he wants his portion of whatever it is that she's because there's something about this tour she's going on with lotto i feel like that's offensive to him that's very offensive to him especially when there were tour dates that they had planned that she wasn't showing up to and then you pop up 
doing this shit. Um, he feels like people just kind of take his kindness for granted. Take his, um... <sighs> this energy is really heavy. Very heavy. It's like people don't take him seriously, like... <laughs> And then when he speaks his truth, now he's the bad guy. I do feel like this is a bit of a lover's quarrel, okay? <sighs> they definitely had something going on intimately. This was a, a personal relationship. I feel like they had a strong connection, or so he thought. Um, he feels like she let other people get in her head and devise her, make her feel like she was more important than the rest of the group. And I feel like, okay, he's a feeler. <laughs> he's a feeler. He definitely um, is very sensitive, as most Virgos are, very sensitive to energy, okay? There's something about being very... Um, like his his senses are kind of heightened. Very, he has a good lie detector. Okay, he can he can definitely see through people, but it's still giving people an opportunity to prove him wrong. Okay, so he can see clear. He can see people's intentions, but he likes to allow people to show to try to prove him wrong. Like, but then it's like he's every time he does that the truth comes out and he's like damn I was right <laughs> I was right about you all along but yeah it's like letting people get in her in her head tell her that she's bigger than this that she doesn't have to be tied to Yachty and I get a sense that's why he went ahead and released those tracks to show like bitch I made you like no, literally. And I definitely don't feel it was out of malice. Like, his feelings are genuinely hurt. He, he really felt a strong connection with this girl. Now, I do see, you know, it is there is a bit of revenge being sought here. Like, you know, hoping that everything kind of fails and she suffers the consequences of her um, betrayal, okay? I feel like he has made a few calls to put a stop to things that she may be trying to pursue. There's something about, I don't know if he's getting writing credits, but he's definitely going to make sure that he does. See, people, see, they're trying to paint this image like he just um, has this God complex and thinks he's better than everyone. But it's like Yachty really be out here, like, supporting people, like, pushing people, encouraging people. Like, he can see um, the star energy or qualities in people, even though they might not possess all of the talent. He's like, we can build that. We can work on that. I feel like he's a great AR um, and there's definitely something about not minding taking the back seat, being on the back burner, letting people shine. But people do be shitting on him once they get comfortable, once they feel like they built their own, or they they've accumulated. Because I have to stress, like it's not built on on their own. Like all of this, especially the um the resources. Yachty puts a lot of his resources in the people that he fucks with. A lot of his time, his energy, and he does not receive the um, the credit. A lot of people feel entitled to what he does for him. He's very sensitive. 
very sensitive. I feel like <laughs> there's definitely this wanting to see everybody win type of energy. I'm not saying, you know, he's not mean. I do feel like it comes across as mean, but it's just the truth. It's that Virgo shit. It's just the truth. Not knowing how else to, how else can you say the truth? How else can you, like, how else can I break this shit down besides what's obvious? Okay. Is what you said about her true or is that just your point of view? Because she says she's being bullied. So is he bullying her? Or is what he said about her character, her being rude, her talking down to people? Is that true? I do see I, I do get a sense that he, he might have even said it is like definitely protecting her image definitely protecting her image and then getting tired of that there's something about her being very wild re very reckless very rude in a bit of a you know a thought like a bop she's a bop <laughs> There is somebody here close to him that she may have slept with. And I feel like even that he wasn't mad about. It's just the level of disrespect that people show him. The people that he's invested his, his time and energy into. That's when he gets um, offended. I can't lie. He had a lot of love for this girl. That there was a real relationship here. It was supposed to be. Not saying he wasn't interested in other people as well. Okay. I also feel like there may have been a woman that he was putting on the back burner because of this relationship. feeling like she's gonna die out because nobody else believed in her that's what I keep sensing like did you think you on top now didn't nobody else believe in you but me didn't nobody else support you but me didn't nobody else see it for you but me and yeah you could get any ghostwriter <laughs> you could get any ghostwriter but they don't have the the consideration the compassion the, um, they don't understand you. Yeah, he was in love. Hell yeah, he was in love with this girl. Like, this shit really hurts his feelings. It's more than just, like, it's a whole spit in his face. People be shitting on this nigga. People be shitting on Yachty. Like, and I... I feel like if he really fucks with you, then it's sincere. But, it, I mean, okay, what about the podcast? What was your intentions there? Like, what was that about? Ace of Wands, like, it's just the truth. Like, it's not, <laughs> it's just the truth. Now, his, his, his approach, the way he said it, the way, like, that may have been misconstrued, okay? That can be taken... And it's some, some, some girl they sharing. And he already feels like he sees what's going to happen. He, Virgos are very, um, psychic. He sees what's going to happen. There's a woman that's going to come boost his head up. And then he's going to go off and do his own thing. I feel like Yachty has seen this happen so many times while he's been in the industry. People connect with him. They get what they can from him. Other people come around, start telling them they don't need Yachty. Yachty's just trying to control you. He just wants da 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 da. And then they fall off. I feel like he keeps seeing this. It's bit, I keep picking up Cat Williams. Like his energy is very straightforward. I feel like there's a sarcastic kind of wit that people don't really get. Um, when he's talking, like, it's, it's not meant to be 
hurtful. It's like, bro, we we're adults. Like, is this the truth? I'm not. I'm not trying to hurt nobody. Feeling. What is this? Cause I feel like um, one thing he gonna do is get to the bag. He might um, release an independent project. I feel like there's also there may be another woman that he's working on curating some type of image for. Like he's really good at that. What is this eight of cups? Okay, he might have another baby on the way. Somebody could definitely be pregnant with the, a little boat. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, I feel like he's just going to focus on his his internal internal revenue. There is something about um the IRS. I feel like he even tries to school people on that, on setting money aside for your, um, you know, your taxes, helping people, like telling people you need to get, um, you know, financial literacy. Like he's he's a good friend. Like I cannot take that away from him. I don't know about shit else, but he is a good friend. He he's very well rounded. He's very grounded. Like he's um, very simple too very simple very cut and dry like there's no gimmick there's no um facade with him if he trusts you you know and people take advantage of that shit and he really he's like okay i already see your character but please prove me wrong please <laughs> please prove me wrong what is this i can see like there may have been somebody that he wanted to marry, like literally like proposed to, but something's going on there. I definitely feel like he's a wizard. He's an occultist. Okay, he... What is this? There's this energy of getting out of his feelings, getting to the bag, like, um, like not mixing business and pleasure. I feel like that was a lesson here for him, but he's kind of very solidified in whatever it is he does. Okay, this has something to do with the city girls, those writing credits. He has hella writing credits, like y'all be, y'all be straight. And I feel like that's why he can be so so giving because he has established this nest egg where he, you know, like he he has money to play with. Somebody's like, "Oh, you on his side." I'm not on his side. It's just energetically he's he's right. Like <laughs> I don't know what it is what is this hate train? I don't know where this is coming from. I can hear somebody his energy like, oh, you're on his side. Oh, you're I, I'm very unbiased. I'm just going with what I sense. This man, if he fuck with you, it's the long way and people keep shitting on him. I do feel like there may be a Scorpio here. There's somebody here who um his the relationship is evolving with. He may be considering settling down, getting serious here, giving somebody his last name. Hello. Take what applies, but mm -hmm. okay, you gonna make a video? 
Yeah, I'm gonna go live because like I had started a page called Dear Jesus. Okay. And um, I started like four months ago. 